Here we go at it again. You're looking for something just a tad bit bigger than the last home we uh, went and vlogged on. Well, you're in for a treat today. Make sure you stay till the end. We'll throw in some uh, some uh, other little hot spots in this town. We're getting to it right now. value out of this do us a solid like comment subscribe hit the bell so you're notified every time we throw new content out each and every week do me a solid if you got a question reach out i can't read your mind call text email do what you got to do to get that question answered i'm talking i'm helping people each and every day and i love it if you need help reach out all right so we are in valley center kansas this is going to be north of Wichita, west of 135 North. Another nice little small town. Slightly bigger than Rose Hill. I uh, got a couple close friends that live up here. Let me throw it out here again. Not steering you towards, not steering you away. Just reporting the facts. So, slightly larger, the, uh, your median home price is going to be on the higher end as well. Last I had checked, $240, $250, so a little bit, uh, a little bit higher than uh, Wichita. So for a lot of the people that I had been showing homes to here in Valley, um, they like the schools. The schools are a big draw around here. Schools, just kind of that small town vibe as well. And we're actually going down their main street. And once a, uh, they do, they do parades and stuff down here. Some uh, mom and pop places. I'll tell you uh, over here, old Big Larry's. Pretty good burger. You want some real good grub, some cold drinks. The hive down here is really good. Really good. Can't can't say enough good things about the hive but yeah we're over here all on the main drag and uh, they do a lot of uh, parades and stuff over this way very big um, very big and, and uh, pride pride of home and town and all that catch a little bit of everything here in uh, Valley you know you got your your typical ranch homes you know it's bungalows um, with the popularity in the school systems they're looking at building more homes so I mean you know believe it or not you're gonna have to find those neighborhoods that uh, that have those homes that are you know Four, five, six, seven hundred thousand plus, you know, it's just crazy to think about. You got the small town vibe, you know, you keep, uh, you keep going. 
and you'll find you'll find your rural spots as well on the outskirts of town and whatnot. Just kind of it, it just kind of one of those small towns. It seems like just about everybody knows everybody. You know. But I mean, this number, the, the the top two things, and like I said, not steering you towards, not steering you away. There's their middle school. Is uh, is the schools? You know the schools, and they just they like that um, hometown feel, small town vibes. You know, everybody just kind of. looks out for one another and whatnot just kind of slower slower walk of life not too far from Wichita you know we've got the high school over down here on the right little things about uh, Valley Center in particular is uh, just look how big that school is is uh, you know it qualifies for a particular loan um, USDA your uh, rural development loan so this is one of those zero down loans that it uh, qualifies for So, I mean, and that's just your down payment. But, I mean, you got some options. Uh, we just swung back around, heading back into town. But yeah, I mean, you can get a little bit of everything here. Um, it's just crazy to think how much uh, how much you could get versus some of these other bigger cities. Like what uh, six, seven hundred thousand dollars is going to get you for a home? these neighborhoods we'll show you kind of a more established mature neighborhood and that was the end Yeah, I mean, if you're looking for some small town vibes, I mean, you have mom and pop run uh, stores and whatnot. Uh, some local local businesses, not just your franchise. If you're looking for something just a little further from uh, the beaten path, if you're wanting to stay outside of the quote unquote city, I mean, you can't go wrong with Valley Center. There's a uh, quite a bit going for the small town.
Yeah, they have their own swimming pool, their own park. There's City Hall over there. Just a quiet, small little town. back over to the main drag. Like I said they got their little park, swimming, their swimming pool and all that good stuff's over there as well. So, technically, there's a Walmart over at 53rd Meridian, but that's technically Wichita. So, not a, not a whole lot of options, technically, for Valley Center. You got, a, you got the Dollar General. Mm, putting up some apartments. Nice. It's uh, surely coming into its own, no doubt about it. Still has a nice little small town vibe though. Gotta find ourselves a place to turn off because uh, the road ahead is locked. surely coming into its own there'll be some growing pains and whatnot not too far from the beaten path solid schools quiet 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 so this is something this is something more your speed you know I'm just a call text email away And if it's not, hey, you know what? That's okay. I'm still here. Make sure you reach out, call, text, email. You got questions, I might have answers. Do us a solid, like, comment, subscribe. Until the next one, guys, we'll catch you later. Oh yeah, one thing I almost forgot, trains. Yeah, you're not gonna, you're not gonna miss trains over in Valley. Figured that might be something you might want to know.